Hi everyone, it's Maya from Plants with Maya and this is Connor. Say hi Connor. Say hi. Say hi. Um, today I want to show you how I um, plant or put my plants in Leka. Um, I got uh, this three plants that um, we're going to um, put in Leka today. It's been um, um, sitting in water since um, it arrived just a few days ago. So I just um, now getting ready to um, put it in Leka. Okay, you wanna watch? Oh, are you excited? Yes, are you going to watch? Okay, see? <laughs> okay, hold on. So first of all, this is the King of Ontarium, the VGI. And I'm really excited about this one. Um, so pretty. It, it has a little damage, but it's okay. Uh, it's going to survive. And the new leaves will be adjusted to or or climatized to my environment so I'm not worried about this one I know it's not going to eventually make it but if it will shoot more uh, leaves so I'm not too worried uh, if I lose uh, the original leaves so I have this part right here and so A little noisy. I don't know if you can see. Are you watching? Okay. Are you trying to help me? One is helping me. Yeah. Okay. Are you inspecting? Are you inspecting. So I'm going to put it in this vase, clear vase. Um, I think it will hold the water really good like this. So that's one. And uh, the next one is uh, this Queen Anthorium. And um, also, this one is going to have new babies right here. I don't know if you can see, but it's right there. So, um, so I have third on my third leka first. Uh, on my container and then Just topping it off all the way 
to the top right here and this one I think I'm going to use this container it doesn't have holes but it's going to hold the water or the vitamin water I call it the vitamin water and it's perfect size for this container and then the next one is um, this is Antorium radicans and um, it's been in water for a few days um, I uh, lost one leaf but uh, the root system are all good so again it was also in water for a couple of days now. so I think I'm going to put it here in this container This leka that I'm using is a different one that um, I used before. Um, it's called, the brand is called Grow It. Uh, the first one was um, Hydroton, is that how you say it? Um, so the first one is perfectly rounded. Um, but this one, they're all um, like different sizes. They're irregular, but I don't mind. I don't really particularly care about that. So, um, and also this one's uh, a little cheaper per bag. So, there you go. Um, this one I'm going to put it right here in this container right there so the leaves are a little crispy uh, now on this part right here but it's because the plant is adjusting um, to my environment so um, I am not worried about that. Um, I just know that uh, this is normal. And uh, the important thing is, you know, uh, the plant is alive and there's going to be new growth on this, um, this plant. So um, yeah, eventually it will be um, uh, it will be adjusted and um, it will go really well so um, I already pre-made my vitamin water if um, you haven't seen uh, the video where I show my friend uh, how to uh, mix this uh, please you know I will link the video um, below in the description uh, you can watch it um, so basically um, I have just uh, one gallon of water and um, I have this uh, flora micro um, from general hydroponics and this come um, in three sets uh, one set and three things <laughs> in one package um, this and this one so um, I ordered this uh, from Amazon and um, you can buy the smaller um, container as well um, uh, this will last a long a long time because um, I only use a uh, quarter teaspoon per uh, a gallon of water um, so you know you can imagine um, you know 
this will go a long way um, right. and then for the vitamin or additional vitamin I use this super thrive and um, I just mix it um, with my vitamin water so um, I just kind of mix it all up and just pour it about a third of the container Just kind of see, um, lift it up to see how much water I need. A little bit more. There you go. And for this one. And um, I have this uh, cutting, uh, it's Milano Chrysum cutting. And so I think this one, I'm just going to um, continue to leave in the water until um, it establish some roots. Uh, right now there's one tiny little root there. So I think I'll just leave it um, for a little bit more in, in water. Then I'll transfer it to uh, uh, Leka later, once there's some more roots in there. So um, I guess that's it. Um, hope um, you enjoyed this video. And um, if you had a question, um, please uh, put it in the comment section below and uh, I'll try to get back with you um, uh, with questions uh, uh, answers to your questions or uh, if you have further tips on how you do your leka please uh, share with us too all right well thank you so much and um, hope you have a good weekend bye